Hi, this is Sarah from The Savvy Professor, and in today's video, we'll discuss how to fix the E12 error code on your Lock and Var water heater. But first, what does the E12 error code mean? The error code E12 indicates that the main burner in your heater has failed to ignite. The following are some of the causes of this error. A blocked air intake or flue exhaust pipe, a faulty gas valve, a defective burner, or a malfunctioning main control board. Now, let's look at the best solutions to fix the air. Check the spark electrode. Inspect the wiring on the spark electrode. Check if there are loose connections and damaged wires. Connect firmly any loose connections you find and replace any damaged wires. If the wiring is okay, inspect the spark electrode itself. If it's damaged, replace it. Check the gas pressure. Check the pressure of the incoming gas supply and ensure it's 4 to 14 inches for WC for natural gas and 8 to 14 inches WC for LPG. Check the plastic hose installation. Inspect the plastic hose and check its connection with the gas valve and the air inlet. Ensure it's connected correctly and not damaged. Replace the plastic hose if it's damaged. Check the air intake pipes. Inspect the air intake pipes and ensure they're installed correctly. Check for obstructions in the pipes. Clear out any obstructions you find. Check the gas valve. Test if the gas valve is working correctly. To do this, you'll require help from a professional. If it's found to be faulty, replace it. Check the flame sensor. Inspect the wiring on the flame sensor and the flame sensor itself. Check if there are loose connections or damaged wires. Connect firmly any loose connections you find and replace the damaged wires. If the flame sensor is damaged, replace it. Inspect the burner. Check if the burner is dirty and clean it if necessary. If it is damaged, replace it. Inspect the heat exchanger and clean it if it's necessary. Replace the main control board. If none of the solutions work, you'll have to replace the main control board. Manually reset the unit once the issue's been fixed. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Till next time.